Valorant failing to open or launch can ha happen due to a various reasons. Crashes, black screen or even bugs can cause Valorant to not start. Leaving players frustrating and sending them straight back to their home screen while these types of errors often get fixed by the developers when they affect the majority of the player base. The camera may not arrive if there are not many players reporting Valorant failing to launch. When this is the case, you will need to apply one of the troubleshooting methods that should get Valorant back to running shape in no time. The first thing you need to do here, update your graphic drivers might be their update available. So update your graphic card if you are using the NVIDIA go open the geforce and go into the driver sections check for updates if there are any updates available update it and restart your pc might be this will fix your issue in case if it's not working then the second option you can do here just go into the c drive arrival games the valorant folder just cut this valorant folder don't copy it just cut cut and paste over here after the, doing that just uninstall the uh vanguard from here once you click on the uninstall uh, uninstall well vanguard after after that just click again on the reward vanguard and exit the vanguard if it's still available over here in the taskbar icon and then uninstall the reward folder just delete this you can uh, also just like this one and shift delete delete all and uh, after doing this just reinstall the valorant okay now simply you need to log in your account and download it again it's easy to download um, just like this if you don't know i'm just showing you the method just click on the play button sign in. okay it's already done my bad just go back Okay, after signing in, just click on the game download and it will redirect you on the downloading page. Over here, just click on the download and it's around 60 to 70 MB. After downloading, just launch it and you will get around 230 to 40 or to 60, 70, 80. Around this, you will get another download from the Riot client. And just download that. After that, you will get this interface the simply riot interface and that time when it start downloading valorant once again just pause and close the riot client after closing the riot client simply you need to go into the c drive once again and this time you need to cut your valorant folder again from here and paste it back over here once you done this process just uh, launch your riot client and it will install the vanguard again and you can just play your valorant without having any issue if still you are getting any issue just let me know in the comment section i'll try to respond to you as soon as possible for me till then just take yourself allah peace bye bye and yeah don't forget to subscribe this youtube channel for more in interesting videos and uh, yeah you can also join my discord for further help see you in the next video Take care.